pants is vivid, raw dog food we call due to salmonella and listeria. And this all comes from EqualityInsuranceMagger.com. You know, I have anyway this before. If the human food is not safe, please don't expect the dog food to be safe either. Because the animal food will get me called as well as the human food. Man, let's go ahead and face it. So a pet food we call was announced recent after investigation conducted a test for salmonella and listeria, which can bring as bring as positive. The volunteer we call include product shipped to over 1,500 customers, specifically rivet duck for dogs, jump with lot number 22853. The investigation was sparked by a single customer complaint, which ultimately led to a discover for both salmonella and hysteria. It was reported in an email alert from Vivian. According to the Vivian Wall statement online, the product in question had the last of the shipment department warehouse on December 6th of 2023. So far, only one customer complaint has been reported and there have yet to be any other reports related to the contamination. I'm willing to bet they probably got more complaints. They, they, they probably is they probably taking a slow time to put it out in these articles. Because just like human food, dog food don't, don't got called way too many times as well. Coming into contact with either salmonella or listerine, excuse me, listeria, can result in mid symptoms including fever, muscle, ache, nauseous, vomiting, and diarrhea. In more serious cases, symptoms such as headache, stiff neck, confused loss of balance, confusion can develop as well. If not treated correctly, more severe long-lasting issues may arise, such as brain and nerve damage. I want to tell me what y'all feel about this. It just right out of the old playbook. You know, at this point again, you would think more extra work, or not only extra work, but extra curriculum, I should say, would have been put in place to make sure these things don't happen as constantly have, have they have happened. Well, unfortunately, that's not the case. Again, y'all, human food is not safe. So please do not expect your animal food to be safe as well. When it comes to contamination, whether it's human food or animal food, all of it at the end of the day is going to get contaminated. That's, a, that, that, that's just facts right there. No matter what, all these food, whether it's human or animal, is going to get contaminated because too many, too many of these stores that came out over the years. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this whole situation. Leave your thoughts down there in the comment section, and I will put the link to this, this, story, this story in the description box. And I will see you all next time. D-Lo out.